welcome back to another episode of Engineering How, where we're going to learn how to calculate a motor's torque requirement. If we have one, the mass, which in this case would be a 20 kilograms, two, the speed that we know that we're moving this 20 kilogram mass, and three, the pulley diameter on the end of the motor, which in this case would be 50 millimetres. So the equation we're going to use is torque equals force times the radius. So the first step that we need to take is to work out the force under gravity to lift the 20 kilogram mass. So force in newtons equals 20 kilograms times acceleration. And in this case, we're going to use gravity, which is 9.81 meters per second. The force is 196 newtons. Step two, we want to work out the force under, under acceleration for the 20 kilogram mass. So first of all, we need to work out the speed in meters per second. The force is 20 kilograms times 0 0.5 meters per second, which gives us a force under acceleration for the 20 kilogram mass of 10 newtons. When we add these two together, we get a total of 206 newtons. We now have all the elements to work out the torque for the motor, the torque requirement for this motor. First of all, we need the radius in meters at the moment. This is in millimetres. The diameter of the pulley is 50 millimetres. When this is converted to metres, it works out as 0 0.025 metres. The torque is 206 newtons times the pulley, di pulley radius, giving a final torque of 5.15 newton metres. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Please tune in for more.